Whoa, check it out. All right, thanks for joining me on Lunch with Crunch. Dad, um, we're going to be doing Panda Express. But have you guys tried their new hot chicken? It's a new, or no, new hot orange chicken. I'm going to give that a try right now because I'm excited. I love spicy food. And from everything I've seen so far about like how spicy it is, I'm pretty excited because I love their orange chicken. And I want to see how spicy this actually is. Let's go give it a try. All right, so check this out. We're gonna get straight into it. I'm pretty hungry. Panda Express, two item combo. Spicy orange chicken, broccoli beef, chow mein, and rice. Boom. Panda Express, first things first, try the spicy or the hot orange chicken. They say it's spicy, here we go. It really doesn't have that much of a kick. I mean, this is, I feel like this is just, we need a little bit more food. I feel like this, this we need a little bit more food. <clears throat> Chow mein or lo mein, always the best thing here, I think. There is no kick to this. It looks like there's a lot of chili on, or like chili peppers or whatever on here. Mm. You know, it's not that spicy. Oh, you know what? Broccoli beef is better. It's got a lot more garlic to it, which is kind of nice. Mmm. Mm-hmm. But yeah. No heat to the, kind of sad actually. There's no heat to the uh, the hot orange chicken. I mean, you would think being called hot orange chicken, it'd be hot. Mm, not hot. Huh. That looks a lot better with all the chili sauce on there. The chili sauce has more heat, for sure. Mmm. It does taste like orange chicken. It's just not spicy enough. This chili sauce has 10 times more heat than the orange chicken itself. There was like a TikTok I saw of someone, um, he was eating like a bowl of the new orange chicken and he's like, ooh, there's a kick to it. I'm like, hmm. There's no kick. Now that's chili sauce. Mmm. Oh yeah. Ooh. Now this chili sauce has a kick. They should have just doused. They should have put this chili sauce on the orange chicken and called it a day. Ooh. Oh yeah, the chili sauce has got some heat to it. And I'm, I'm liking it a lot. Yeah. Mmm. Good. Um. Oh. No napkins. <clears throat> I feel like Panda Express for me. It's kind of a nostalgic place because it's kind of the, that place that you like go to like at the mall. And I don't want to eat like Sabaro's pizza. Um, I don't want to eat at Sabaro's or, you know, Mongolian barbecue or whatever, or like, you know, hot dog on a stick never gets you full. So then your best option is like Panda. Like, I feel like that's, that's kind of what Panda Express is to me. And it's a big nostalgic. You know, I grew up going to the malls and hanging out at malls and eating this over there. You get so much more food when you go to a mom and pop place. Um, gosh, I was so excited about this orange chicken being spicy. You know, the mom and pop place, they give you a ton of food. And it's good. 
And you know why it's good? They use a ton of MSG. I don't know if Panda Express uses MSG, but like a local mom and pop place, you know they're using MSG. I mean, that's their primary seasoning. It's so good. I already know it's not gonna be the healthiest thing out there. I'm not eating it for the health. I'm not eating it for the health benefits. I'm eating it because I just want a bunch of takeout Chinese food. There you go. That was uh, Panda Express hot orange chicken. Um, I swear that chili sauce is spicy though. That's, it's got a good kick to it. That chili sauce is good. They should just make, a, they should just add the chili sauce into the orange chicken. It'd be so much spicier. Also, you know what's also good is too is like, you know, about mom and pop places is like, yeah, you're supporting local businesses. Um, don't get me wrong. I've actually had some not so good Chinese takeout from, you know, those places. But if you find a good local one next to you, and I'm not talking about they have like, they have different things too. They have like salt and pepper pork. They have Kung Pao chicken, but it's like good Kung Pao chicken. They have like General Sao, and you're like, oh, okay, like that's it's all like super Americanized, but it's like super flavorful. And I, you know what it is? I just think I just need that MSG. I need a little bit more seasoning, a little bit more flavor in my food, um, especially if I know that I'm going to be eating something like takeout where I know it's not going to be healthy, and I just want to feed my mental health if that makes sense like i want it to be satisfying because it's it's gonna hit that craving and i know it's not gonna be healthy but i still want it because it'll make me happy and making me happy is as healthy it's it's, it's a healthy thing too you know being health being happy is also healthy you know uh i don't eat this every day i don't eat this all the time but when you want something you want something but anyways that was it Thanks for joining me for Lunch with Crunch. Dad, we'll see you guys next time.